Hello everyone, I'm back with more Zombie U. It's me, William Strife, and uh, I just crashed a morgue party. Can you believe it? I had to take on like 12 zombies and they, uh, they didn't care whenever I came into the room because they were too busy getting down with the banging bass. And uh, between episodes I actually found something out. If I switch it off... You hear that? They're like crazy nasty music that says that something bad is happening. So instead, I'm just gonna leave this on, because, um, who knows, I'm... There's a chance I might have to come back through here. Anyways... We're moving on. Um... I got five bullets in my gun. Uh... Actually, how many crossbow bolts do I have? Four. And I've got a grenade. So things are looking good. These bad boys may have, must have OD'd. Okay, now that I feel safe... Another grenade. Another crossbow bolt. And three bullets. we got in here? It's empty. Uh, da, 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 da. Close that door. People partying when they should be prepping. Well, kind of figured that something bad would happen. Anyways. <clears throat> got eight bullets in the gun now. Still not the maximum. Losing you. Okay, so I'm losing the. Just gotta keep going. Piece of shit. I knew you were coming. I saw you coming from a mile away, you piece of shit. med pack. Definitely need it. Okay. Oh, shite. Down you go. One more. I'll take a quick moment for myself. Where are you? You're 
further in there. Dear God, there's ass loads of ordnance in here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Connected to the network. I got my map up. All right. There he is. Corridor combat. Come on. Take that helmet off. Play fair. Damn zombie. Almost down. A finish. Okay, nothing else is showing up on the radar. It doesn't look like there's anything in here that I can loot. Alright, yep, this room is pretty much empty. Hello. Except for this. Which is empty. Isn't that nice? Um. Lots of crap in here. Wow. Well, it's definitely looking like someone who uh, understood the possibilities of the plague lived here. That's to be certain. CCTV cameras all over the place. Well, well. One coming. It's Sandra. One will turn out in less than 12 hours. Ronald Friedman, if you're ignoring me, I swear. Answer me for God's sake, Ron. This isn't where I want to be. And my character's moaning and groaning. How do we get over there? Oh, there's an air vent. I suppose this is my only opportunity. Well, quite clearly, Ron is dead. Um, my incessant looting is getting the better of me. Actually, I'm going to take that healing item that I picked up and put it up in my hot bar. I've got a 
flare. <clears throat> Loot. Metal container is empty. I don't even know. Not an earthly idea. The desk is empty. One, five, two, seven. Okay. Let's hope that this doesn't turn out like the last time I successfully put a code in. One, five, two, seven. Shit! Not gonna get any extra surprises. Get rid of you. Prepper here, you read me. Looks like it's heating up in there. Find the kitchen and use the rubbish chute. It's your quickest way out. Uno momento. The stuff I need. Animal meat. Can be rotten. Eating this item may refill your life gauge, but beware. If it is rotten, you will lose a little life. That being the case, I'm going to take this. Okay, well, evidently, I'm not allowed to put it back. Just drop that crap. There's a possibility that it's going to hurt me. I'm not going to bother with it. Ooh, can I... No. My virus side shot is full. Dear John, I'll never forget everything you've given me. Our time together was the happiest of my life. But now those memories are tarnished. And I want it to stop. We both know that you don't belong in the trauma unit. But the injustice of it all has changed you. You're not the man I fell in love with anymore. The man who risked and lost everything to try and prepare the world for the coming storm. That man seems to be dead. Looking back, your letters become more and more bitter over time, filled with cynicism and contempt. God knows I can't blame you after everything that's happened, but I don't want to know this new man. I don't think we have anything constructive to say to one another. If I do somehow survive the blight, if any of us do, it'll be thanks to you. I owe that to the man I loved. He'll remain a part of me forever. Forgive me. Dear John, I'll never forget oh, everything crap. you've given me. Okay, well... No point of that. I read everything. Got everything out of here that I can. Oh my god! There's a shitload of zombies in here. Die. Piece of rotten meat. <laughs> Alright. I've gotta recharge my flashlight batteries. I'll cut it out for you guys. Okay, there we go. Um, so it seems like the prepper had a falling out with his girlfriend. 
can't really blame her for falling out with him. It didn't seem to be going, uh, things didn't seem to be going very well. Um, well, you know what? I think I'm going to stop here. Uh, I've successfully made my escape from that horrid, horrid apartment up there. And I don't even want to think of what could potentially be further down the line here. But <laughs> I'll find out soon enough, I suppose. Uh, but until the next episode, I'll see you guys later. I'm William Strife. Bye-bye.